Hi Capricorns, this is Rogue Tarot. Welcome back to my channel. We're getting right into how does your person feel about you. We have heart with the key, welcoming love, meeting the one, opening your heart, getting together and perfect. Anything else for my Capricorns? Because that just came up um, very quickly here. Anything else from my Capricorns person feel about them? We have date, meeting someone new, dating, getting back out there, planning and set a date. So Capricorn, how does your person feel about you? They feel like you have options, that you're getting back out there, dating, um, meeting someone new, have multiple options. This could have been someone who broke up with you and now they think that you're um, partying, having fun, getting out there again. Um, this person, I feel like they still have a key to your heart. Um, they still feel like you have feelings for them. We have soulmate, soul connection, partnership agreement, and soul contract, so they do feel like um, you are their soulmate, but they feel like you're the one that kind of got away here. This could also be you dating this person and they realize that you're not like anybody else from um, their past Capricorns. You know, you're not with the conflict and drama like the um, options that they had in the past. You're like a breath of fresh air is what I'm getting at Capricorns. Yeah, the lovers in reverse. But they feel like they don't know if you feel the same way, Capricorns. Why is the Ten of Swords showing up with the Nine of Pentacles? Yeah, because they feel like, you know, um, for some of you, this was an ending. And they feel like you're happier of being single. They feel like there's nothing they can really do with this King of Pentacles in reverse. The Ace of Pentacles wanted to come out in reverse with the lovers. So th this could be them realizing that they made the wrong choice. They could have... Um, ghosted you to try to see what else is out there and they got burnt right there's because they realize there's nothing else right three of cups energy and now they're trying to come back and you're like no like you hurt me now you're trying to come back because you're trying to be sneaky here they could have put you in a third party with a mother or father of um, their child something messy like that because there was a ten of swords here um betrayal with these knives stabbing in the back a lot of drama here a lot of petty words and arguments with the page of swords a lot of conflicts they kind of want to let bygones and be bygones and try to at least apologize to you. They feel like you don't want nothing to do with them, Capricorns. We have the Eight of Cups in reverse. Yeah, they don't want to let you go. They're sad that they hurt you and they kind of want to restart here, Capricorns. But with the lovers in reverse, you're like, no. you. I thought you were my soulmate, but the way you played me, like, no, I'm, I'm out. Bye. So clarify the nine of pentacles capricorns this is how they see you very strong independent you know not really torn over them i feel like they're in their heads about how to apologize to you because you're in your element yeah they can't really um move on from this is they're really in their heads about it with the five of wands energy ace of swords how they feel they want to take you out and talk about this about how things didn't work out they want to call you but you don't care, like, what's done is done. Like, just leave me alone, right? Emperor, Page of Swords. Energy. What does this Page of Swords want to say? Yeah. Uh, they want to tell you how um, this Leo energy. They want to tell you how unhappy they are and how they cannot stop thinking about this. How they're full of this regret and sadness over here. Why is the Sun and the Five of Cups showing up with this Page of Swords here? Camera. Reminiscing, keepsake, perception, learn from the past, make memories. Yeah. We have coffin, endings brings new beginnings, growth, change, liberation, transition, and self. Focus on self, self worth, time to heal, shadow work, self appreciation. Yeah, so you're you know they realize you're taking this time out to deal with things on your own. Um, they have a they kind of they understand this connection that you have because soulmates is there, but they feel a connection every time they look at your pictures. Um, it gives some hope that they have the chance to take this risk and come forward as crazy as that sounds with the Ace of Wands is here for a new beginning with the twos, the two of swords and the two of wands. This is karma getting them. You know, they're basically reaping what they're sowing at the moment. Karma is not gonna stop this from balancing out because you're blocked them. You don't want nothing to do with them. You spiritually you spiritually awaken, so to say, you don't you know, you learn your lessons. You don't want to go through a whole near dealing, a whole year dealing with the same BS from this person. Um, they have definitely dropped their pride and ego here with the King of Pentacles, the Five of Swords. You know, 
They're trying to um, understand your emotions here with the Queen of Cups, how you're feeling, Capricorns. But you don't want nothing to do with them. You're done thinking about them. You're kind of like isolate yourself from them. Virgo energy. Clarify the Gemini energy with the lovers. Yeah. You're just going to let this situation in. And they're, they're going to be angry about it. They're angry about that. They're, <laughs> they're, see, it's like they're really angry that you have multiple options that you're getting back out there and dating. And there's nothing that they can do about it. Because it's their fault that they made the wrong choice here. That they took you for granted. And now they're feeling stuck because they're drinking a lot. They could be going out a lot. Buying a lot of drinks. Um, alcohol here. Kind of just drowning their sorrows. <laughs> and to things not working out. I think it was Libra's I did. Um, was that like Saturday? Someone got a drunken phone call. Capricorns were dealing with a Libra. Why is the nine of cups here? Yeah, someone's having a tire moment. Where they're going to... You might get a drunk phone call. This could be the Libra that some of you are dealing with. They're, they're going to come in. They're dragging their feet, but they're going to try to reach out to you, Capricorns. It is what it is. It's Libra energy. Anything else for my Capricorns here? How does this person feel? We have chemistry. The attraction you feel is mutual. Fate. This is a destined partnership. Because, yeah, there is a soulmate connection like we saw at the beginning of the reading. But you're kind of done with this. We have this relationship can stand the test of time, and I feel like this is past energy to what you thought this could be. This person chose their true colors, not enough chemistry in the world to keep this moving um, for some of you is what I'm getting. Let's see. We have put away the computer. Working less will help strengthen your relationship. Yeah, so maybe this person felt like you were working too much, not focusing on them, but kept the you gotta do what you gotta do, right? This person not supporting you, it is what it is. Gotta let them... Deal with that. Deal, deal with what they have to deal with. We have reconciliation somewhere from your past is returning to your life. Codependency. Yeah, addictions are affecting your romantic life. And then we have worth waiting for. Divine timing is out working on love life. Because I'm getting a selfish energy from this person. Like this person just wants to have their cake and eat it too. They just want you around for this codependency, right? To be emotionally um, available towards them. At one point, you feel like you thought this was marriage. A lot, a, a lot of you might get back together, and this is going to happen with reconciliation and wedding. You're going to forget this person and, you know, have the strength to work through what you have to work on. And, you know, celebrate this union again. But that's for a short short few of you, Capricorns, is what I'm getting. This reconciliation is this relationship can stand the test of time. For some, this is faded. But for others of you, it's based on codependency, chemistry, lust here. Third-party energies. So Capricorns, I'm going to leave it there, guys, and have a wonderful week.